The best way that I have found in creating a comment box in your Google Sites is to use Nixie. It is spelled P-N-Y-X-E. And so once you are at the website, just click on Start Now. And uh, when you are using it the, for the first time, you do need to sign up. And after you have signed up, it will ask you to give a name uh, to, to your website. And um, so this is a way for you to tell, uh, like if you have uh, one uh, comment box for each one of your websites, and uh, this is the way to distinguish you know, one comment box from another. And so I'm going to just call this one IPT37 uh, uh, comment box demo. Okay. And uh, there are term they have the terms of uh, use. Uh, you can review that. And I agree to that and create account. Okay, so it is creating a, a new comment box for me. And so this is the code that you uh, need to use for your comment box. Uh, but it, it, it gets a little easier, okay? Uh, underneath right here, it has the installation for different platforms. And uh, we know we are going to use it for Google Sites. And so we'll just click on Google Sites. And uh, after that, uh, we need to give them, uh, give it uh, the, the URL to your website. And so uh, let me go to my website, which is right here. I created this demo page. And then, you know, this is my website. So I'll press Command C or Control C to copy this URL. I'll go back here and then click on this. I'm going to just delete what it says here and then I'll press command V or control V to paste the this URL and then click on this get uh, uh, gadget button and this is the URL that I need uh, to identify this gadget okay all I need to do is to copy this copy okay highlight and copy it and then go back to my web page and now uh, for me to create in, insert this comment box all I need to do is go to insert more gadgets and this time instead of searching for gadget I'll just click on add gadget by URL okay and here I will you know delete this uh, HTML you know slash slash 2 uh, and then press the uh, command V to paste that uh, long URL right here and click on add okay and I can modify the size of that comment box and uh, 2000 looks a little bit long for me and so I'm going to change it to 1000 okay 1000 pixel uh, that's the height and um, and then some of these optional uh, things that you can decide whether you want to add it or not um, I'm going to just click OK and then click save and now when people come to this the, the web page you can see that there is a comment box right there okay and uh, I can give uh, it some comments uh, let's say this is a just a test comment okay and click send um, and for people who are posting the comments you know you can uh, you know add uh, have these uh, different options and I'll just click uh, finish okay then comment will show up right there okay so for other people who come to your website even though uh, they don't have a copy uh, or, or the, an account with Nixie they can still comment anybody can come to your website and provide a comment however only the author the creator of this this uh, um, how to say that the, the, the creator of this comment box can um, can delete the comments so for example when you come in here you notice after you click more now I can remove the, this post and I can even edit it but for other regular users who come to your website and, and want to post a comment uh, they, they don't have this website so you don't need to worry about like other people deleting each other's comments or if you do see an inappropriate comment you want to delete it you know you can come in and remove it all right and so this is a very professional comment uh, the box feature and you can use it for free